Hey guys, what up here, and welcome back to NASCAR Wait, the chase mode, owner mode. <laughs> We're going to be doing Atlanta, and possibly Bristol, it all depends on how Atlanta plays out, so... Yeah, I don't want to just do a video where nothing much happens. Then again, if you watch the Dirt State Tone Apart, like 38, that was kind of the case, but that was a transition season. I wanted to have the next part be focused on the transition season. <laughs> so... <laughs> Yeah, point standings, we didn't do too well after uh, Vegas, but should be okay to Atlanta, I'm assuming, maybe. I don't know. Let's just head right into qualifying and, I guess, try to get a pole. I mean, gotten at Daytona in California, so I guess we'll just try to shoot for that goal. Uh, turn four, already got the pole, so really there's no need for me to try for the second lap. I have to do it because if I don't, it just puts me in last, so I have to do these two laps. So. Yeah, that... But what? Excuse me, game, what? It said I was first! What? The fuck? Ah, this fuck. You know, I come back to this game and I think, you know, hey, maybe this will be a chill part. Nothing stupid will happen. Something stupid happened. How did I get last when it said I was first? What a bunch of bullshit this game is. Kiss my ass. What's wh why tell me I got first and then just flat out lie? <laughs> oh, like I don't want to get mad every part, but oh my god, some of the shit is just retarded. I'm gonna try to take my damn time because I know they're just not gonna give me room. I'm afraid to make sudden movements because the driving model is garbage. We're gonna try to do what we can. To the bottom here, gain spots. They, well, you see, look at look at the speed I have. That's, <laughs> I'm just so speechless by that. It just it just baffles me that 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 happened. Well, comment section, uh, do your thing. Figure out what happened, because <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Well, I thought I could chill for like half a lap, but I guess that's asking too much. So we got a little bit of damage. That shouldn't hurt me too bad. Car is just scary fast. I mean, I'm trying to be very cautious and not, you know, do something stupid, but it's very hard when you... I can't even hold a straight line. The car just doesn't like it. But yeah, huh? we're moving our way up through the field, though, so that's nice. It's like the game knows. It's like, it's like the game knows, like, it was gonna be too easy, so they just decided to throw me last. Now, thankfully, nothing dumb, nothing dumb has happened. We're just, man, we're just plowing through this field. We're already up in the 16th in four laps. And, yeah, we were just, just hauling ass in the corners and straightaways. Really, the only thing that's gonna screw me up is if the AIs are gonna just not give me room. But, as of right now, I mean, this is going about as smoothly as it could for, considering how far back I am. So, I'm gonna turn four here. Get by Sadler, Kurt Busch, Dale Jr. Man, he's just for flying. I'm not gonna get room, am I? No, no, oh, barely. I barely got room. Thanks, Newman. I always appreciate it. And what's now there beside me? Oh boy. Okay. And I have a hell of a run, but I can't go anywhere, and I just hit Kenseth. Uh, it's, it's okay. We're we're just moving our way up to the field. The bumps, though. Normally, I wouldn't complain about the bumps, but boy. How like sensitive this, this steering is, and just the, those bumps just really make the car feel unbalanced. But it's okay, you know we're fine. We're in fourth place. Vickers is gonna go for the lead, huh? Okay, we're right there, so it's okay. I'm just gonna get a hell of a run in the back straightaway. Try to maybe go to the outside of Jimmy if I can, or just wait till off turn four. And yeah, I guess we'll just wait off turn four. It's just amazing the speed we have in the car in the straightaways. It's just, this is a bad idea, but I'm going to send it. Full throttle. Let off the gas. Boom. In the lead. Perfect. Jimmy's going to do the crossover, but that's to be expected by just completely almost Adam Petty it. But it's okay. We're fine. We're in the lead. We can chill. And it, it should be a, a very smooth sailing from here. Starting lap 16, we're, I would say, like right at the halfway point. But for some reason... At least on this game. Normally, the 10% races are always uh, 32 laps here at Atlanta, but this is 33, so I don't, I don't know why. It's just something 
worth noting. We're still pulling away, cruising, I mean, just, you know, doing just fine. About to catch some lap cars, but as long as they're just kind of like, you know, single file or just, just one car just by themselves, like, it, it shouldn't be too bad to get around them, so it should, no, no tomfoolery should happen here. Starting on 27, again, nothing has really happened, we're just still getting ground lap traffic. Also, since we do have such a lead, I feel like some dumpkin may happen or I might you know, wreck myself, so I want to lap as many cars as I can just to better my chances of uh, getting a better finish. So, Thankfully, they're spread out just enough. They're not side by side or anything, so it's been pretty easy for the most part. So that's nice. So as long as they continue to beat you you know, single file, this should be a, a pretty easy win. Well, white flag. <laughs> no. You know, I, I don't know what to say, I mean, I'm just so, just still surprised the game, like, tried to screw me over with, uh, me being last in qualifying. So, yeah, we'll probably do Bristol, because that'll be a classic shit show, and, you know, I might as well just throw that in there. I was thinking of having it being, like, a double feature of, of uh, short tracks, which would be short track shit shows, but, you know, we'll, we'll throw that in here, because nothing happened in this race, so... I'm just kind of curious how many cars I lapped uh, in this race. Uh, I, I, I want I want to see that. So, how many did I actually end up lapping? So, 33, and how many were on lead lap? Okay. Um, yeah, I'm sure I lapped some cars, because that's, uh, that's not really close. So I think I was around, like, right around Robbie Gordon. So, I don't know. I, why does it not say, how do they finish at NASCAR? You know, you do, you, just, you do whatever. I don't even, my, next race. Next race is Bristol. Let's look at the point settings real quick. We went from 10th to 4th, so that's good. So we're within the, the chase thing. So, yeah. David Gillen's the leader. I don't understand that still. Someone in the comments explain this, please. I'm just confused. How is he beating Jeff Gordon? I don't know. Okay, well, let's go on to Bristol and try not to wreck too much. Oh my god! Oh! Oh my, I went into the fans. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting that. Jeez, we murdered like hundreds of people there and I don't even care. Well, off turn four, I don't know what this lap time is going to be after that. <laughs> if I get pull, I'm just going to laugh. And where we place? <laughs> first okay well it's good to know we got the pole after barrel rolling flying through the catch fence and god damn that's 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 how i want every race to be you qualify you go into the catch fence you kill a couple people finish your qualifying lap get the pole that's my kind of race so here we go bristol we're normally pretty op here but lap traffic's gonna play a big factor as well as just how the track drives so here we go 50 laps I'll catch you when something interesting happens, which will be very shortly, I imagine. Oh my god, did you see that? Like, just that... It's, this track's weird. It's it's just weird. Like, if you turn to the right a little bit, the car, like, wants to weight shift over. It's just, there's so much instability in the car. Why is Tony Stewart back here? Alright, well, as long as they're single file like this it shouldn't be too bad to get by them but this is gonna be a pain in the ass because this car just sucks there's no way to hold this perfect straight line or the car just does that like it's this track is harder to drive than a damn uh, it's just god if real life races were like this oh my god I, why is there not enough why is there not more flips here at Bristol Calibrate there if Future Wave puts that in. 
that's like one of the few instances where I can actually just kind of go around this track about about as quick as I could. And the lap times, my god, they're there. I can get close to a 13.9. If there was nobody on the track, and I think I hit my marks a lot better, I think I can get like a 13.9, which, god, even for 2018 standards, that's like insane. That's fast. I don't even think that's faster than it is in even real life. And sure as hell faster than what it was in 2007. Oh, now we're back in the traffic, so now I just gotta just baby it around here, as I think we're almost gonna lap. Probably the whole field. I mean, we're lapping Tony Stewart a second time. This is a, this is a weird race. Dave Blaney's outrunning Tony Stewart by a good bit. Oh my god. Well, I almost flipped there, but... I mean, we're just... So close to just wrecking or do some stupid... So that's... I really want to lap as many people as I can. Just in case, because it's it's gonna happen. I'm just shocked it hasn't happened yet. When they're well, at least when they're single file like that, it's not too bad. I don't know what kind of corner that was, but it worked. But yeah, I'm just afraid. As long as they're single, yeah, like I said, single file like this, it'll be fine. But I'm just worried. I'm amazed the back bumper, the rear, the rear bumper, yeah, whatever, <laughs> is not completely just bent in. We've had so many close calls in this race so far, and. It uh, hasn't gotten bent, so my OCD is not really triggered. Well, now, now, now I am. Well, the front of it is, so that's lovely. Yeah, <clears throat> finally it happened. At least I, at least I can't see it. If I just don't look at that, I, I don't, I don't see it, and it's not there. It doesn't exist. We should be close to lapping the whole field. Maybe Jimmy's second. So, yeah, we might just damn near lap the whole field, and then we're about to lap Tony Stewart a third time. So, yeah, that's that's pretty disgusting, as I just hit Jimmy again. Um, yeah, I think Jimmy is the lead, uh, second place, so just need to get by him. Don't know how I'm going to do this, so it's going to take her time. You know, we got a big lead. We don't have to just throw it all away. You know, we got to savor this. Now, now, now my back bumper's fucked up. Okay, now my OCD's really going to piss me off. Okay, and there we go. We have a lap on the field, so Jimmy was second. And get a good round turn four, pull away. All right, let's not make a fatal critical mistake. Oh my god, I feel the car just wanting to flip over. I, I can't even stress how just tedious, annoying, unfun it is to have this driving model. I... I can't, I can't hold a straight line. There's just, there's just no way. It's either I'm gonna super underdrive it or overdrive it. That's just me. That's me rocking the analog stick back and forth like I normally would for any other game. It's just, it, it really just, it doesn't like it. That was actually not too bad. But see, I need the whole track to make that move. Is it is the white flag? I didn't even pay attention to it. Yeah, I'm gonna lap Kenseth for like the third time. It's, I, I mean, I mean, this car's just fast, and we just hit the outside wall. Okay, well, let's try to flip it. There we go, we flip. Woo! All right. Oh, barrel roll into the frame of the shot. How, how beautiful. Oh, and I, I flipped out of the shot. Oh, my God, that was some ungodly shit. Some fancy word that I couldn't say. Did that race, I just saw that. Did the race say really like 12 minutes? Oh my God. Okay, so we got Mark Martin second, Rudiman sixth, and, huh. That's weird, Mark Martin ha actually had like, that's, how, how did Hamlin have, this is weird, cause how did Hamlin have a 13-9? Some of these lap times are Gillen in the 11th. I don't know why he's such a beast, but you know that's that's just how the game rolls. It was like that for the PS2 version too, is where it's like where it had like Jeff Gordon like third in the 30s. I guess EA didn't watch the 2007 NASCAR season because Gordon was not 30th in the freaking point standings. So after Bristol, we can go to Martinsville in the next part as well as Texas. So it's going to be kind of like an inverse of last of this part. Instead, we're going to a short track and then a mile and a half. Well, this one was a mile and a half in a short track, so that's cute. 
So point standings, we actually do have the points lead. Gillen's still leading, or second, but yeah, that's weird. So there's our top ten. Robbie is Robbie Gord seventh. I okay, but yeah, Sterling Marlin twelfth. Hell yeah! Right. A big shout out to my two or three Patreon supporters: the Dale Reynolds, Roland Hoffer, Weather Bros, Kamikaze Games, Ryan Lazar, and Michael Harrison, Dave Five Hundred Champ Fifteen, Jeff Gordon, Zach Rogers, Racing News Now, Alan Gray, Matthew Murray, and Stephen Willie for a donation again. I can't thank you guys enough for your support and contributions to the channel. It does mean a lot to me, and yeah, all you guys are seriously awesome for what you do. See you all next part for maybe more of the same, so might be a two-for-one upload thing, so two videos in, in one. So, I'll see you all later, and as always, have a good day, everyone.